What's going on YouTube? Josh here with the Alpha Omega Survival School coming at you today with the long-awaited Smith & Wesson Tonto style blade. Beautiful. Now I said I've been do gonna do this video for quite some time now. I think it's been over a month now and uh, finally getting around to it today. Gonna be doing a few tests, probably gonna be a short video, so stick around. Alright guys, so today uh, we're talking about the Smith & Wesson uh, Tonto style blade. I believe this is the SW, the SW7S. And uh, this is the one with the serrations. That's what the S stands for. So, and, uh, I have not used this yet. Today will be the first day I've cracked it open. I love it. It's got the rubberized grip. It's got a uh, coated blade. And it's got the steel pommel, which I really like. I uh, wish it was a solid steel pommel instead of having a lanyard hole, but whatever. Um, that's just my first couple uh, comments on that. <clears throat> I love the sheath that this came with. Kydex, very nice, very heavy duty, heavy duty clip. Uh, this one does not snap on. You just run your belt through it. You can take it out and put it on the other side. I like that as well. So... Uh, I think what I'm going to end up doing is putting some paracord in here and figuring out some way to lace that. You can never have too much paracord at your disposal. <clears throat> so, uh, I'm going to just remove the sheath here. Very nice blade. Very, very sharp out of the box. Um, I've had it out of the box for a while. It's been in my bug out bag. And, uh, I've been waiting for a chance to use it, and I've just been so busy lately. And finally, today, we're going to get down to it. So, um, I'm just going to do a few basic tests. Now, it does not have a slicing belly like a lot of knives do. Obviously, it's the Tonto, so it has the uh, uh, has this edge and this edge and then the serrations. But the, uh, the long, sharp edge, the straight edge, uh, is, is ideal for uh, slicing. does a very good job of making a feather stick not as good of a job as the uh, as the shrade obviously the hollow point on that does a little bit better of a good uh, better job but uh, as far as slicing you know these knives are made more for stabbing and that's just how they were designed that's the original uh, use for them was for cutting out of armor so you need to stab very violently to get out of that um, so there you go uh, with the slicing not too bad um, do a little bit more you know as long as you're you're careful with it you, you're not gonna do too bad of a job this isn't the ideal piece of wood either I just kind of grabbed this it was sitting on the ground so there's that. Uh, let's move on uh, to stabbing. Get down here. Uh, we're gonna stab. See if I can stab this piece of wood here. I didn't. Couldn't find a flat piece. Let me see if. Uh, make sure you guys can see this. Okay. There we go. <clears throat> As you can see, a lot stronger tip. It's just kind of hanging on there with the weight of the knife. Very strong tip. That's one of the benefits of the Tonto style. Very good stabbing. Any other knife would have fallen out by now. Very nice. Okay. I know this is not a very detailed video. 
but I really uh, had been wanting to show you guys this for a little over a month now and I couldn't wait any longer I had to do it today so maybe I'll do some more detailed stuff in the future but this is not really, you know, an everyday knife. This is this is one of those knives that uh, that you know it's it's definitely not a daily thing here. This is specialty, and I bought it for specialty. I stuck it in my bug out bag, um, and uh, and that's what I bought it for. You know, I have the the shade to uh, do the general things and I have some other knives to do the general things but I wanted to add a Tonto to the collection and this was the one that I got and I was a $50 knife and I picked it up uh, for $27 on eBay which was awesome so I love it so far now I'm gonna cut some rope We've got some uh, pretty thick rope here I'm gonna tie this off to the tree and uh, see how well it'll go through it Okay, I'm going to try and zoom in here. I love this camera. Now, my old camera got messed up. So uh, this is someone that I'm borrowing for the time being. I might end up getting one like this. Detail on this is awesome. The uh, high def, very high def. Alright, so I'm going to use the, serrat the serrations here. See how well it will go through this. Okay. Wow. Alright, so as you can see, hope you could see, it went right. Where's the lens? There it is, right through it. Try and get that to focus. There you go. See that? Right through it. Awesome. Alright, guys, this has been the Smith and Wesson SW7. S Tonto style blade. Maybe I should zoom out, it might help a little bit. This is Josh with Alpha and Omega Survival School. As usual, check out the Bible verse in the description box below. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys soon. Have a good one.